Students can foster communication, collaboration, and critical thinking and creating. Standing in front of a group of people and giving a speech is probably the number one fear for most of us. But it is a challenge these Fresno County students were willing to take on. It helps a lot with your public speaking skills. It and it just gives you a little bit more confidence. 16-year-old Eric Monzo is a member of the speech and debate team at Washington Union High School. When we talked to Eric, he and his teammates were preparing for the sixth annual Migrant State Speech and Debate Tournament. It becomes a who came first, the chicken or the egg situation. After school, we stay until 4.30 and we're constantly researching pro and cons of the subject that we have to do. The kids have to also do a lot of um, work on their own. While Eric has been competing since seventh grade, it was a new experience for a lot of these young people. As migrant students, many of them are always in transition because of their parents' work. Because a lot of times they don't have the opportunity because they're moving from place to place. They miss out on a complete sports season or they're not able to be uh, in another, like for band, or other, other programs like that after school. Uh, so this is a special event just for them. And we're hoping that this builds on their confidence and they can join other programs. It was not only a lack of confidence that had prevented students at Parlier High School from ever participating, there was also a language barrier. Primarily, we have a lot of ESL students here at, the, at Parlier High School. So most of them speak Spanish, but knowing the fact that they would be able to participate in a Spanish category kind of got them excited. Although 17-year-old Viriana Gallardo could have competed in the English category, she chose to join her classmates who participated in the Spanish category. She did it to give them support because she knows what it's like to be new to this country and struggling to learn the language. I know it's hard because I, I was like that too when I came over here. Like, it was hard, really hard, because I didn't know English, so they were just like bully or something. They will make fun of you because you didn't know English, so now I, I feel them, so now I could help them. It would be the first time Parlier sent a team to the regional competition. The students did well enough to come in first and second, qualifying for the state tournament. For the first time, the event was held in Fresno and hosted by the Fresno County Office of Education's Migrant Education Department. It was a huge undertaking. It took us about 18 months to prepare. We started working with the hotel initially just to find a place to house 460 students plus the chaperones and all the adults that get involved. On a Saturday, just under 500 students converged on the campus of Washington Union High School. They came ready to compete. The financial benefits, according to the National For example, Union, students with autism can better communicate. Radicales a lo largo de al menos cinco años. The day ended with an award ceremony, but coaches and teachers say there were no losers at this event. To see children that are being successful and they're part of the migrant community is absolutely amazing.